Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and styling, guys. So, today is a lifestyle video, I guess you can say. Beauty, fashion? Yeah. <laughs> lifestyle. I have a beautiful table coming from Restoration Hardware. For those of you guys who don't know, I am redecorating my downstairs area, starting with that area. I've been in my home for some time now and I was getting a little antsy to move and it could be the New Yorker in me. I don't know. I just, I like change and um, I wanted to do something different. So instead of moving and jumping into a higher mortgage, I decided to just redecorate. So I'm starting with the downstairs, which is my living room, dining area and my foyer area my kitchen to be quite honest i was gonna get someone to come in and paint the cabinets i think it's a lot in my opinion um so i may do it later on not too sure because i have like an espresso color which is okay but my floors are dark so everything just seems a bit dark so i'm trying to lighten up the space with lighter furniture my coffee table comes today uh, i should get the guy to come and put up my gilt mirror from restoration hallway on thursday hopefully everything goes good that that thing is heavy and then my sofa should be here on friday guys and you guys know i got that from crate and barrel um the fabric that i got is called chanel it's monet it's chanel like a chanel fabric and the color is frost I'll probably pop in a photo, but back to the table. That should be here today between four and six. I'm super excited. So here's the debacle with the table. I first ordered the table in the smaller size, and which was still not really small, but I ended up seeing it at the Restoration Hardware outlet, and they had it in front of a sectional. And I think the smaller size was perfect for the sectional because of how the lounge part, lounge chase part on the sectional was. I think if they would have put the larger one, it wouldn't look right. Now, in my case, I didn't purchase a sectional. I did get a sofa and I got like a 90 inch, 98 inch sofa custom made with that fabric. So the table that I got, I believe it's like 70, 70 inches long yeah i think it's like 70 and the other one was like 60 so that 10 inches definitely is going to help and it's deeper than the other one so i'm just excited to get it and it's in like a, a smoke smoke oak brown color now online it looks a certain way i did not see it in the store so when it gets here i'm just gonna have to play around with the colors if i do decide to get like a console table that kind of matches it. Restoration Hardware did not have a console table to match, which is odd to me. I mean, I've been looking for that same color with something on there, but I didn't see anything. So I'm just gonna get creative with it. So they should be here around four to six today. Um, and I'm excited. So yes, I'm working, I'm drinking my green juice. You guys know I love my green juice. This is this is watercress, dandelion, kale, green apple, cucumber, cucumber, green pear, and ginger and kiwi. There's a lot in here actually. Um, and you guys know I love my Nama. If you have not purchased you a juicer, please get you one. Invest in one. Don't cheat yourself and buy something that's cheaper. It's just not going to last. And um, do some research. Do some research on the best the best one. There's two that pops up, which is the Nama. And I think the other one's called Curving or Curving or something like that. Um, but there's a gentleman on YouTube that has a really, really detailed video on why he chose the Nama. I like the Nama because it's easy cleaning for me. But... Other than that, I'm just going to be working today, doing some work. Going to get off probably around 4 today. They should be here between 4 and 6. I'm just going to move some stuff. Actually, I'm not going to move my rug that's sitting there. I'm going to let them sit the table on top. So, of my, my camera just, not my camera died. My 
freaking storage was full, which is crazy. Anyway, so yes, I'll bring you guys along when they do actually come with the table. So the video is really going to be based around the table. I'm going to try to get really, really good shots of it because I have not seen anyone post about this table. Um, and it was... I am a member now of the Restoration Hardware crew, so I did get the membership price, but the table also was on sale, which is still not really a sale, <laughs> but I'm glad that I actually got it. So sometimes you just have to get what you want, right? I have a vision. I'm going to try to execute that the best way I can. My dining room table that I currently have, I'm trying to sell it. So as of now, I'm just going to buy my chairs until that table sells and then I'm going to replace it. So it's a glass table. The only issue is that the bottom of the table, the base is chrome and I'm trying to bring in gold. I don't want my base to be gold, but I definitely wanted to get rid of that. So the chairs I actually got from Wayfair um, and they're just the same price as the ones at our house. Like <laughs> The ones at our house, the reason why I'm not going with those is because... The color was not giving me white. It was giving me more of a cream beige. And I really wanted the, the chairs to like go with the sofa, even though they're far apart. I don't know. I just really wasn't liking the ones from our house. So, yeah. But, like I said, same price. And I, I'm going to see if I can find a photo and pop that in for you as well. There were two styles that I wanted. And I went with the rounder ones. Um, and I did buy six chairs before I had four chairs, which is crazy. Yeah. I only had two on each side and put two at the head because where my chandelier was placed. Oh my God. My chandelier was in a terrible position. So I got six chairs. And I think it's going to look really good once I get like a nice centerpiece and just kind of go from there. Just change everything. But once they come today, I'm going to let, definitely let you guys see the table and give you guys some good, good product shots of the table. Can't wait to decorate and just everything be done downstairs so I can work on my office because that's going to be my next little project. Um, and then my guest bathroom and possibly my master closet that's in my actual bathroom. I'm thinking about changing that as well and making that into like a sitting area for me to meditate. Um, like my leave my nice pajamas in it so almost like a dressing room just for you know nighttime stuff like getting unwinding from work separate from my actual closet so once they come i will bring you guys along there and that's about it guys so i will catch you guys later and this video is not going to be super super long but i just wanted to show you guys what i am going to be excited to be receiving today from restoration hardware so i will catch you guys later on bye guys hey guys welcome back so here we are like a couple of weeks later i did not post the other video about the coffee table from restoration hardware because it was just a whole thing so they delivered my other one i got the smaller version i'm glad that i did i think the other one would have been like too big for here but it has a chip as well and i'm going to show you guys but let me turn on some lights. Now, here's the thing. Restoration Hardware has really nice, they have really nice stuff, right? And, you know, you want your items, like, really, well, in, in excellent condition, right? So, basically, the lady was like, oh, we can come repair it. Now, here's the thing. Repairing something that is supposed to be new, I'm not down with that. Like, I'm just not. My mirror, here's my complaint with my mirror, and I'm probably going to do a full video. So the mirror is up, but when my handyman came to put it together, he said that the silver piece on the back, the mounting piece, is slanted. And we he pulled it off the wall, and I was like, oh, whoever put the mirror, who packaged the mirror, who had to put it together, it is slightly off, it's like an eighth of an inch off. You can't really see it. I know that it's there, that it's slanted, but the average eye wouldn't see it. Anyway, now the table, I'm gonna show you guys the table. 
let you guys see how that looks. Let's flip you guys around. I love the table, guys. I do. So, these chairs are not staying here. But here's the table. The table is really, really nice. It's a really, really, really nice table. I got like a 60 by 30. It looks lighter on camera, but it's a really nice, I don't know, I can't, it looks green on camera to me, <laughs> but it's a nice brown wood. Um, I'm waiting to get my rug. I needed the table to be here so I can see the exact color. And that's also before I order my, um, what do you call that? My chairs. So it's a really small gash right here. And the lady is like, can you guys see that? I don't know how it's gonna come up on camera. You know, this is my vlogging camera and you guys already know. So it's here. She's like, oh, it's just the, um, it's just the paint. Sweetie, it's a gash. Like I can feel it. And that's my thing. Like at this point, they should offer me something for free. Um, because I'm sure it costs them more money to keep sending a delivery person out here. So here's what I'm thinking, guys. <laughs> and then the mirror is up here. And I don't even know if you guys, you probably can't even see, but it's a little slanted. When you're here, you can actually see it, but it's a little slanted. And then really close over there, there's like a little, I don't know if it's like the paint or the wood itself. All I know, guys, is that it ain't it, okay? So, now, I'm a little annoyed, a little frustrated at RH, okay? So, but it is coming along. They left it here, but they're gonna come back. I, I don't know if they could give me money off. I don't know, just give me something, something off what I want. This, this is what I want. So guys, I want them to say, hey, what can we do for you? Can we give you something that's under $1,500, right? Is this blurry? Can you give me, can we give you something under $1,500? Yes, you can. I'll come repair this, right? But then I also want you to uh, give me two task lamps. That would be nice. I will take two task lamps and be done. I would deal with the damn crooked. I still want my 10% off of each item. But give me something because I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think? Am I being a pain? But I, like I said, I feel like when you're paying so much for things, it should be in good, con great, con excellent condition, new condition. You shouldn't have to alter anything if you purchase something new. You shouldn't have to have a repair company come out if you purchase something new. No, you don't have to do that. If you're buying something pre-loved or used, yes. If you damaged it yourself, yes. Other than that, no. So, but to be honest, I'm gonna show you guys from this way how it looks. I really like how, I still got my grill in the living room, guys. <laughs> I'm moving slow because I just have to do some things. These are my old chairs. I'm gonna get some different chairs, but it looks, it looks good. I like it a lot, but again, I'm not 100% satisfied with them. And I get it, nothing is perfect, but however, you guys charge so much money our age that you need to make sure that things are perfect, okay? I'm just saying. I'm just saying, it needs to be perfect. But I didn't wanna make this video super long. Like I said, I wanted them to keep it, I wanted to keep it here so I can see the size. So the next thing I'm actually gonna do is on the sides of my mirror, I'm gonna add some photos. And guys, over here behind my dining table, I think I'm gonna put a huge gallery wall. I don't wanna be pictured down in here, but I want like huge photos here. Typically, people would put their mirror there, which I know but I wanted to do something a little different. It feels different, I'm not even gonna lie. It's almost like sleeping at the head of, the foot of your bed, or if your head is facing the door. Um, but I am gonna put something here. I'm gonna patch those holes up because I had mirrors there before. And you guys seen that. I'm gonna get a rug. I did see a rug from CB2. And 
I like the rug a lot. I just don't know if the rug is going to, is it blurry? It could be my glasses, guys. I don't know if the rug is going to give me the wow that I'm looking for. I'm gonna go back and see it again, and then I think I'm gonna just purchase it. I'm hopefully it goes on sale a little bit more, and then I'm gonna put curtains up. And then this photo here, I'm probably going to paint over it with, um, I don't know, maybe just paint over it again, because I, I actually like it. There's nothing wrong with it. And I, I don't know, I could probably put like a little, I don't know, something. I just need to get creative. I just got a whole bunch of Ikea. Let me show you. I have a whole bunch of Ikea <laughs> frames that I had for a long time. And what I did was I came in here and I put these on here. Cause you guys know these freaking Reba things, this is not gonna work, but I put them here. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. I may put it upstairs in the hallway. But I'm trying to get it together over here, guys. I really am. But one last look over everything. You guys will see a final reveal. So that's the last, nope, it's not the last big piece. The last big piece, I'm gonna say, will be the two accent chairs that I gotta get <clears throat> and my rug. Everything else is small. I wanna say everything else is under $1,000. I think if I get these pictures that I saw online, mm, I'm trying, I'm trying not to, it's like 600. And then if I do a gallery wall here with these photos from another place, it may cost me a little chunk of change, but I don't think anything is as, as expensive as the two accent chairs. And then I'm just going to go from there. Yeah. Look at my grow. <laughs> I'm going to change my planter here and I'm going to change the planters over there get like a huge pot. My plant is leaning, so I need to get one of those things to set it up. I overwatered this one the other day. Guys, like I said, this has been sitting here since I put it together so long ago. Literally like a part of the living room. Um, but I'm looking at my mirror now, I can see that it's slanted. <laughs> you guys probably can't even see it, but that's it. This is gonna be a short video. Maybe I'll add in some more things that I do today into this vlog. But I'm gonna go check home goods again, like I normally do, and see if I can find um, a rug or something and kind of go from there. This stuff is changing. I just have, it's just not all the way together. It's coming along. So I would say this, if you are redecorating your home, take your time, get exactly what you want, don't budge, period. Now here's the funny part. Do you guys know that Restoration Hardware does have like a, what is it called? Hmm, I don't know if it's called like a magic explorer program or something like that. Basically what you do is you put your name on the list and tell them what you want. So I put my name on the list and told them that I wanted the mirror. This was like months ago. She called me yesterday. She told me that she had the mirror. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> So it started zooming in and I need to know how to do that because I don't know how to use it on the vlog. But they had a mirror that came in and guess what guys? It was $7.90. The thing about the outlet is that you don't know, maybe I should go there today. You don't know what is going to be wrong with the item. So that's the only thing like, it could be worse than this one, but $7.90 that is a steal? I paid a lot of money for this. So. Yeah, so I don't know, maybe I'll go there today, maybe. Maybe I'll go there today, maybe they have a rug or something, but if I don't, this will be the end of the vlog. If I do, you're gonna see more from today. So I will catch you guys later in the next one. Bye guys.